So again, we will see what are the ways we express the concentration units. One is the mole fraction, then we have molarity, then we have molality, and then we have percentage composition. And uh, this uh, video will deal with molar uh, molality and percent by mass. So, molality, we'll do a question on molality now. Calculate the molality of solution when 48.25 grams of calcium chloride is dissolved in 485 grams of water. So, as we know from the definition of molality, molality is moles of solute divided by mass of solvent in kilogram. So, what do I need? I just need to calculate the moles of calcium chloride. This is a simple question. So, mass of uh, calcium chloride is given. Calculate the molar mass of calcium chloride and I get the moles of calcium chloride. Once I get the moles of calcium chloride, you have to divide it by the mass of solvent. But uh, the mass of solvent should be in kilograms. So, convert 485 grams into 0.485 kilograms and I get the molality as 0.895 m. We will do one more question on molality. How many grams of water are needed to dissolve 27.8 grams of ammonium nitrate in order to prepare a 0.452 molal solution? So now uh, what they have asked is the amount of water or they are asking for the mass of solvent in grams. And molality is given and the grams of solute is given. So what we can do is, we will first calculate the moles of ammonium nitrate, the solute. So moles of ammonium nitrate will be mass of ammonium nitrate divided by the molar mass. So once we get the moles of ammonium nitrate, from the equation on molality, molality equals moles of solute divided by mass of solvent in kilogram, I can get the mass of water, the solvent in kilograms. So molality is given as 0.452. And we have calculated the moles of ammonium nitrate as 0.347. So, mass of water, I get it as 0.768 kilograms. So, the answer has asked in grams. Therefore, convert kilograms into grams. And I get 768 grams of salt. This is one more question on molality. The density of uh, 20.3 molar methyl alcohol or methanol is 8 uh, 0.858 grams per milliliter. What is the molality of the solution? Water is the solvent. And um, what is it? Look at this. In this case, molarity is given. The capital M is given and they are asking you for molality, the small m. So, this is one important question which involves a lot of calculation. So, just listen carefully. I have to start with molarity and then go and find out molality. So, let's just define molarity first. As you know, molarity is moles of solute divided by volume of solution in liters. And in order to calculate molality, you know that I need the moles of solute. So, from the values of molarity, I can get the moles of methyl alcohol or CS methanol. Uh, molarity is 20.3 uh, m is equal to moles of methyl alcohol divided by 1 liter because molarity is moles per liter. So, this gives me the moles of CH3OH as 20.3 and once I have the moles of it, to calculate molality, what else I need? I need the mass of the solvent and you know that molarity involves solution and molality involves solvent. So, how do I get the mass of solvent? So, in order to do that, let me first calculate the mass of the solute, the CH3OH. I know the moles of uh, methyl alcohol or methanol and multiply it with the molar mass, I will get the mass of the solvent. And you know that the volume of the solution is 1 liter, which is equal to 1000 milliliters. So, from the volume of the solution and the density given, I can get the mass of the solution, which is equal to 858 grams. So, what do I have now? 
I have now mass of the solute. I have the mass of the solution. So I can write mass of the solution is equal to mass of solute plus mass of solvent. So now from this I can calculate the mass of the solvent. And mass of the solvent I get it equal to 208 grams. And as you know in molality the mass of the solvent should be in kilograms. Convert this into kilograms. And I get mass of the solvent as 0 0.208. So now I have all the things which I need to calculate molality. The moles is equal to 20.3 and mass of the solvent is equal to 0 0.208 kilograms. And hence molality is equal to 97.6 molar. So what do you see in this? Is, this is a special question in which Molarity is given and you are asked to calculate the molality of a solution. Let's do a question on uh, percent by mass. Percent, what is the molarity of a solution? That is 26.0% by mass phosphoric acid and has a density of 1.155 grams per milliliter. This is the question in which the percent by mass is given. And molarity is asked. So we know that molarity is moles per liter. So our first job is to get the moles of the solute. So how do we get the moles of the solute? It's given that 26.0% by mass. That means we have 26 gram of phosphoric acid in 100 gram of solution. So therefore, moles of phosphoric acid will be equal to 26 divided by 98. That's equal to 0 0.265 moles. So we have the moles now. So we need to get the mass of solution. In order to get the mass of solution, let's first calculate the volume of the solution in liters. Volume of the solution is equal to mass time, mass divided by density. And uh, mass of the solution is equal to 100 grams divided by 1.155 the density and hence the volume of the solution comes as 86.9 milliliters. So now convert that into liters I get the volume as 0.0869. Once I have the moles and the volume I can calculate the molarity that's equal to 0 0.265 divided by 0 0.0869 and hence I get the molarity as 3.05 What is the percent of calcium nitrate by mass in a 1.5 molar aqueous calcium nitrate solution? This is the question Molality is given and they have asked you to calculate the percent by mass. And as you know from definition, percent by mass is mass of solute divided by mass of solution times 100. So I need to get the mass of solute first. So molality is given, which I know as molality equals moles per liter. So using that, I can get the uh, mass of solute. 1.5 molar solution means we have 1.5 moles in 1 kilogram of solvent. And I know the molar mass of calcium nitrate as 164 grams per mole. So using the formula mole equals gram over molar mass, I can get the mass of uh, calcium nitrate that is equal to 246 grams. Once I have the mass of calcium nitrate, uh, that is the mass of solute, I need to get the mass of solution. So uh, the mass of solvent, because it is molality, the mass of solvent is 1 kilogram or I can call 1 kilogram as 1000 grams and hence mass of solution is equal to 1000 grams plus 246 grams that's equal to 1246. So I have both the mass of the solute and mass of the solution and hence I can calculate the percent by mass and uh, percent by mass is equal to 19.7.